What's good everyone, Ace here, back at it again with yet another retro gaming video. Hope you guys have enjoyed the retro gaming series so far, especially with the new look for 2017. If you guys are not familiar with retro gaming, be sure to check out the link to the playlist down below so you can familiarize yourself about what's going on here. Now, this week, we are bringing you guys Toe Jam and Earl Panic of Funkatron. Now, before I talk about the game, I have to just talk about the character name itself not even earl earl's normal is fine earl reminds me of a 90s patrick star but wasn't a star and but he was a rapper big dude sunglasses and everything now toe jam i always thought this was very funny when i was growing up as a kid and i remember like when i would ask i asked my mom i was like mom i want to get this game now obviously this game when it first originally came out the first one of the series was back in 1991 but when I had uh, when I had my Sega Genesis, I was like, I want to play this. And actually, the first time I actually played it was during the um, Sega Channel. And if you guys remember the Sega Channel, Sega Channel was basically where I think it went through Cox Communications, and you basically got a this uh, Sega Genesis cartridges cartridge where you were able to connect the uh, aux cord in the um, behind the actual game itself on a cartridge and it would stream sega games to you got to you and i always thought it was dope so when I, I had the opportunity to play this i was like oh man i need to play this i was well behind of course but it was fun so let's fast forward a little bit now toe jam and earl panic on funkatron <laughs> interesting title right uh the game was developed by john johnson van sanger productions published by sega um it was released in north america for 1993 and it is for the sega genesis now with this game itself the basically the plot behind it is toe jam and earl make it back from earth now when they were in the first game they crash crash landed on earth two rappers they had to find their way back now that they're back on funkatron the problem is when they came back from earth they brought earthlings with them so now all the aliens are what well quote unquote actually they're not even the aliens the earthlings are actually the aliens um but toe jam and earl and the rest of the people within funkatron is uh scared so basically what toe jam and earl have to do is they have to basically collect the earthlings in jars and then put them back into the ship and after they put them back into the ship, then that's when you're actually able to, um, that's how you beat the game itself. So you're going around different levels looking at, and you can see here, right, I'm throwing the, um, the jars to capture the, uh, human. Excuse, excuse the bird in the background. I'm, I'm not doing any more takes. They're going to be loud. Y'all seen them in the live stream. But with, when you catch them, with, when you catch them within the, um, within the jars as you can see here you pick them up there you go but you have to go all around and once you find all the earthlings it'll tell you that it's been jarred you look at the arrow down below and then you go back to the ship and you drop them off and then you go to the next level now one thing that i wanted to talk about toe jam and earl uh, was the background music i mean this i mean is i mean panic on funkatron so it's like 90s music and everything like that but it just it was just dope all around like i always thought like the beats and everything was pretty dope and it, it's definitely a retro game for sure uh, absolutely you can definitely tell uh just by listening to the background music and everything like that you don't really hear sounds like that nowadays compared to what you were um uh now in the in, in the present so this game was actually pretty much a sleeper as well. I, it didn't really s sell that well within numbers. It didn't. I mean, you had review uh, scores back then. You had like 6 out of 10, 5 out of 10. I think the highest score I saw for it was like 7 out of 10. And it, it like I said, it was a sleeper hit. It, you either liked it or you didn't. Like I said, some people don't go like around going around just looking for humans and everything like that. But I mean, the gameplay was pretty cool, and I kind of mixed both those topics into it. Now, um, could there be a re possible remake? I mean, I know they released the latest one back in 2005 for the Wii uh, Virtual Con uh, Console, and then also for the Xbox uh, Live Arcade. I mean, would it be kind of dope to see a game like this come back in 2017? maybe but i feel like now they would make it very corny i don't think this is very corny back then i thought it was perfect for its time it worked it was it was dope it was fun and it, it, it was enjoyable but now if they bring it back 
I, I don't know. I, I mean, you guys tell me what you guys would think. You guys think a game like this would be dope to uh, showcase or not. Now, I don't really have much to say about this game because this game is pretty straightforward. Um, so, in closing statements, I will say, and I'm curious... I love you guys answering my questions down below in the description box. Continue to do that. So, I'm curious. If you had to choose between uh, being called Toe Jam or Earl, who would you pick and why? And then my next question would be, if you haven't played this game, I don't have any idea about this game besides what I told you and what you look up on Google. Would you play this game now? Let me know down below in the description. I mean, the comment section below. Let me know. And we'll go from there. Thank you guys so much for sticking through this for Retro Gaming. Another week added. I'm telling you guys, we're going to be coming with that fire. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys liked the video, you guys know what to do. Go ahead and hit that like button. If you guys are new to the Game Illuminati channel, be sure to check out the rest of our videos too. Goddamn bird in the background. But yeah, be sure to check out the rest of our videos too. And if you like what you see, go ahead and hit the su subscribe button. It takes one second to do. Thank you guys so much. This is Ace of All Trades with Game Illuminati. And enjoy the rest of the gameplay.
Yeah. 